So in this tutorial, I'm going to tell you how to install Windows 7 and keep all your files and folders and documents and stuff. So you're going to boot up from your Windows 7 DVD and wait for the files to load. So eventually you'll be bought here. It contains a list of your hard drives and the size of the partitions. Now this one, what I've got on now, I have Vista on it. I'm using VirtualBox. So what, what we'll do is we'll select our hard drive where we want it to be installed. Then we click on Next. When this pops up, just read it. And then click OK. Now we wait for the installation process to start and finish. So now we're at this screen, we just need to type in a username. Type in a password if you need. Use recommended settings. Choose your time zone. And then just finish. And then we need to wait a little bit. Okay, so now we have Windows 7 installed. What we need to do is op go to Start and open Computer. We'll snap this to the edge of our screen. Open local disk. Open Windows Alt. You'll see all these folders. So what you need to do is click on Users. Click on one of your folders. And you'll see all your documents. So what you need to do is say if you've got um, your documents in here, you just need to open them and find all your folders that you want to copy. Over to your new ones. I recommend that when you do that, you use the full functionality of Windows 7 and use Aerosnap. Mixing is a whole lot better. So I hope this has helped. Until next time, thank you for watching and goodbye.